Okay, welcome to the channel, and we've got uh, Grim and Mary's new TikTok site. And man, I, I can't keep up with Grim and Mary, man. She's way out of, she's way out ahead. Okay, let's go ahead and watch a couple of these new ones here. Start with this one. Always good to start with a whoops. Oops. Here we go. Okay, so we got the hashtags are Angelina Jordan, Angelina Jordana, songwriter, Mozart's art, original music, Mozart's. Okay, there we go. So that's our first one. Let's go ahead and look at the next one. Okay. Can't go wrong here. So according to the hashtags, we've got Angelina Jordan, Angelina Jordana, Aries. This is, so this is Aries. Mozart's art, Kodomo, baby. And the music's always, I will always love you, Whitney Houston. I think most of you recognize that one. So let's watch this one through one more time. I'll tell you, the family's just genetically uh, uh, predestined for greatness, I think. So let's go ahead and let, watch, uh, we already watched that one, we watched that one, let's watch the next one. He's too much. Oh, tiny. Oh, tiny. What a beautiful kid. That's why I say the family's uh, genetics is uh, out of this world, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> a whole family of beautiful people. And they're also high quality people, in my opinion. Let's go ahead and watch this through the rest of the way. It's too much. <laughs> oh, tiny. Oh, tiny. Uh. <laughs> oh, just a beautiful kid, huh? That's a beautiful little baby right there. Let's move on. Okay, so you can see Grandma Mary in the background there. This one says Angelina Jordan, Angelina Jordana. I'm going to add Grandma Mary. And we have Endless Love with Mariah Carey and Luther Vandross for the music. Let's watch it through again.
Okay. Oops. Okay, the street sign said Galleria. Uh, I am not familiar with Galleria or this place right here. Although I do recognize the Cheesecake Factory. <laughs> Imagine that. So the hashtags are Mozart's Art Original Sound Argentino. All right. Okay, let's move on to the next one. These are going fast today. In my search for freedom, and these are my Okay. Cinnamon bun. Okay, that's what that. I, that's not a street sign. That's a business sign. There's an Apple store. Um, yeah, I don't know where this is. Uh, I'm not that well traveled. I've been around, but not uh, not everywhere, of course. So anyway, this is from uh, the hashtags of Mozart art. And the music is something I can't say, old songs, old memories. Knock Nen, maybe? Knock Nen? Uh, yeah, that's all, let's move on. Juliet. Uh. Julia seems to have quite an affinity for animals, doesn't she? Uh, love of uh, animals, nature, that kind of thing. Uh, yeah, she's a good girl. So the hashtags are Juliet Mozart's art, and the sound is Hendrick Vibes dash Hendrick Vibes. All right, let's watch it. It's only got a, it's only a few seconds long. Let's watch it to the end, then we'll move on to the next one. Okay, next one. Maybe, uh, maybe not. So, you know, the, you know, it was part of the beauty of these little uh, TikTok things that uh, the family has uh, allowed us to see is ju it's just real life, you know. So what does Angelina do in her spare time? What does Juliet do in their spare time, you know? And uh, Juliet seems to be drawn a lot to, you know, animals. She's a member. She, we've seen videos of her at the, uh, look like probably some kind of a shelter where they're maybe adopting out cats and that kind of thing. And... Um, you know, it's just, it's just them, their, their life. And whoever is taking the pictures of the camera, you know, it ends up getting posted. 
and we get to see, you know, behind the scenes. That's what I like about it, you know. There's a lot of really great artists out there. There a lot. There's a lot, tons actually. And they're really good singers. There's nothing I'm not saying they're not good singers, they are. Uh but you know, th there's an extra connection with Angelina because we get to see everything about her life. And is it, why why is that mean? I don't know why that's to me is so important. Uh I'm not that nosy. You know, if they showed us nothing, they showed us nothing, okay? But when they show us this kind of stuff, it kind of draws us in. I really do feel like Aunt, uh, Angelina is like my granddaughter, so is uh, uh, Juliet. And then when the, the little ones there, you know, I, I know more about them. I see more of them from these videos than I do with my own relatives that are live 15 minutes from here, okay? Uh, maybe 20 minutes if I, go, if I drive slow. And... It's, it's, uh, I think it's, you know, the, the, whoever you hang around with, that's who you feel the most, probably the most close to, the most affinity. And I think that's part of it, you know. We get to see this. I think it's genius, actually. So then we go to a concert with Angelina, all the people that feel like they're connected to Angelina, but, you know, we call ourselves the angels, right? Angelina's angels. All of us that feel that way, man. Somebody tries to uh, go up on that stage and do do something to Angelina. There's gonna be a pile on, okay? So it's just gonna be a whole bunch of old guys up there piling on to subdue that guy, whoever is up there. You know, whatever person decides to go and try to do something bad. You know, I, I think a lot of us feel that way. We feel like we want to protect Angelina. We want to you know keep her safe. Uh, and we worry about that stuff a little bit because that's how what people do. They're a part of the family, you know. You're connected, and you worry about people's safety and their well-being, right? Uh, so, anyway, hashtags: Angelina Jordan, Angelina Jordana, Mozart's art, Mary Zamani, art, music, Con La Misma Piedra, Julio Iglesias. Okay, very good. All right, let's move on to the next one. So let's see what the hashtags are. Angelina Jordan, Angelina Jordana, Mozart, Art, Mary Zamani, Art. Uh, original sound, Mozart. Okay, so we have Angelina singing in the car, which is not unusual. Matter of fact, if she's just sitting in the car not singing, that would be unusual. And because Angelina, you know, I really do believe that, uh, you know, music is her passion and it's part of who she is. It's not even really, I wouldn't even call it, is passion the right word? I think it's, it's her. You know, it's, it's not like, you know, sometimes people have an art or talent or, you know, some ability and they they do it. And then people say, oh, wow, that's really something. And people are looking around like, who are they talking about, right? Uh, because it's just who they are. You know, Angelina singing is common. I mean, that's, she said before it was like breathing to her. It's pretty common, right? How many times do you breathe a day? A lot, right? And then you don't even think about it most of the time. It just happens. And, uh, you know, I think that's what, I think that's what uh, uh, is special about Angelina and, 
you know, a lot of there's a lot of great artists out there, like great, great singers, uh, and and they all I'm, they all have a life. They all live, and they all have their motivations. Why why are they singing? Is it something they just do? Is it they're part of who they are? Uh, do they want to be famous? Do they want to be rich? You know, those things are all included in there probably for a lot of people, and. You know, anything can provide you with the motivation to get up every day and, and, and chase your dreams, right? Uh, just whatever is important to you. And, you know, Angelina has said she wants to sing for the whole world. That's her dream. That's a pretty big dream, but she's on her way. Uh, singing at the Westgate in Las Vegas is uh, where Elvis used to sing. I'll tell you, the more I think about that, the more I think, you know, that was such a uh, a moment. Really was a moment in time, as the as the uh, encore song uh, said, and you know that's that that's a big deal because a lot of those artists that are out there singing right now, they're never going to be there singing on that stage. It's not because maybe they don't want to. Maybe it's not their, you know, a lot of people nowadays are YouTube stars or uh, you know TikTok or Instagram or all that. Angelina's on there too. But it's not really how she earned her chops, if you will. She went out and performed when she, ever since she was little on stages big and small for various groups. And she, she even, there's a couple of her in shopping mall. You know, she tried all, you know, she did all that stuff. She's paid her dues, is the, guess what I'm trying to say. But she never, I don't think she ever really saw it as paying dues. I think she just loves to sing, loves to perform, loves to have an audience. If there's nobody there, like in the car, she'll sing there too. It's okay. She sings. That's what she does. That's who she is. And this is just my feeling, you know, I don't know, do I know, I don't know much, I'm just a carpenter, but, um, you know, sometimes I know I have a few people that occasionally like to point out there's a lot of other great singers out there, some people have suggested, you know, you should go check them out, hey, trust me, I do go check out other singers on occasion, I don't go very often, and I don't spend a lot of time on it, because it's, when Angelina sings, I feel it, when other singers sing, I hear it. Okay, and yeah, they have a beautiful voice and they, they're very talented, okay? And on occasion, there's one that'll touch my heart, my soul a little bit. Then I listen to another song and not so much. And, you know, it's like the, the thing that with Angelina is she does touch my heart, my soul nearly every time. Now, probably some of that has grown over time, almost like an uh, it's like a preset, right? I'm already expecting that to happen. So that probably hurries it along, but... It's like the concert uh, in Las Vegas. Went to both concerts. Uh, what's that? 18, 19, 38 songs all together. Um, most of them were duplicated from one concert to the, the late, early show to the late show, except for Moon River was uh, only in the first show, and then um, uh, My Funny Valentine took its place in the second show, so it was only in the second show. But, you know, every time she starts to sing, every time she walks on stage for that matter, Every time I know she's kind of going to be coming walk on stage, I start to get this feeling, like an emotional uh, kind of a feeling. Like it's my, it's just like, it's like I said, it's like she's my granddaughter walking out on the stage, right? I'm so proud of her. I'm so, uh, it's almost a disbelief that, you know, this could be happening, right? And, you know, that's that's the way it is. I don't, I don't think there's really, I mean, I don't know if fans are like that for other people because I've never really been that big of a fan for anybody else. You know, this is the first time for that for me, too. Anyway, let's move on. Speak softly, love, and roll me warm against your heart. I feel your words, the tender, trembling moment oh. start. It's a scary, in a scary clown. Very old, it, right? Sharing a love that only few have ever known. Wine colored days warm by the sun, deep of the night when we are one. Speak softly, love, so no one hears us but the sky. The vows of love we Noodles, make believe Speak. So this is some uh, scenery here. I. That's got to be uh, the, the Chinese theater, I guess. And the, is that the Walk of Fame, some of it? So this has to be in Hollywood. Let me see. 
Are those the famous stars there? I would say so. Never been there either. I gotta get there one of these days. I got lots to do. We're running out of time. I gotta get busy. So let me read you the hashtags Angelina Jordan, Angelina Jordana, Mozart's art, and his music is uh, Speak Softly Love, Four Sets Stab Music Corpse, and Angelina Jordan. All right, so let's move on to the next one. This one we've seen. This is uh, Angelina eating fruit and passing it off to the back seat there. Okay, very good. Okay, well, we're all caught up then. All right, guys. Well, let's, let me end this video here, and there's more to do after the ones that we already saw, too. So, But we'll end this one here. These are all the latest ones that just came out uh, in the last day or so. As a matter of fact, let's go back to the beginning, and we shall... I'm going to refresh the page and see if anything new pops up, because sometimes that happens. Nope, nothing new, just the things we just saw. Very good. All right, well, thanks for hanging in there with me, guys. Uh, we didn't get any big uh, musical moments or anything like that, but what we did get was these beautiful babies. Uh, Angelina in, in the car singing and some nice scenery. And you know what? When you're talking about pictures of like family and stuff like that, it, every moment doesn't have to be a, a kaboom, okay? Uh, sometimes just the picture of the family is, is, is fine. They say a picture is worth a thousand words, right? And you know me, I can probably put a thousand words on there, but we're not going to. I'm going to, we're going to pull, pull the plug on this one. So have a nice day. Thanks for watching, guys. And I hope you guys enjoy these videos like I do. Uh, I don't know what there is about them. I just think it's, it's like sitting down with a family album and just flipping the pages, right? So we'll see you on the next one, guys. Have a good day, good night, good morning, good evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.